Hi everybody, hope you're well. This video was requested by Briar Awesomeness, so thank you for this. This video is going to be about lip and Zanners, but the reason I'm going to talk about this breed is I'm going to talk about it in the context of a new breed on a new on a server. So occasionally we get new breeds released on the server that have never been there before. And people get quite excited and you know they spend a lot of time maybe organizing teams to be the best for this new breed. And you'll see that they, they're in the sales quite high and they'll be quite pricey at the start. And the reason purely for this is because they're brand new. People want them. People want them for trophy colours and, you know, for the breeds. It's it's really about, you know, being a part of something that's really new. So that's why usually they're so popular. But why I think the Lipton's on are so interesting, especially, because... This something happened that has never happened before. And the reason I can show you this is because I have a Lipman's Honor that I got on Christmas Eve. And if you look at the skill set, the skills were stamina, dressage, and gallop were the top three genetic skills. However, when people started to improve them and started to blop them and get better and better genetic potential as time went on, the skills shifted, which was something that's never been seen you know, in, I suppose, in the time of the UK server. I mean, people used to do crossbreeding, there used to be a lot more um, flexibility with crossbreeding, but that's not there anymore. So the skills essentially shifted. This was something that wasn't supposed to happen. Originally, when this breed was released, you can see stamina, gallop, and dressage are the best three skills. So if I go into my question center, you can see that reining is this the best competition for those three skills. So it was a reining breed. However, if I go to the Lipman's Honor description now, you can see that this is not the case. If we hover over here, speed is at 80, dressage is at 90, and gallop is at 61. This is because the skills moved. So essentially, what was the best top three genetics potential skills changed? And I can show you a little bit more clearly if I just bring this. Oh, oh hold on. I can just pull that over a wee bit. So I'll go back to that page and open that up. So if we compare the original Lipman's Honor, so we can see that stamina was higher originally. We can see that speed suddenly became a big player and it wasn't before. Dressage didn't change and gallop actually reduced. So this current Lipman's Honor is actually better suited now to gallop competitions because it's gallop speed and dressage now. So that's why I think they're quite an interesting thing to talk about. I don't know if it happened on other servers because I hadn't actually gone to see, but on the UK server the skills completely shifted and changed. So that's really it guys. So new breeds are just, whenever they come out they'll have a skill set which is here. And the skill set is usually based on what the best three skills are. And that's how people decide what competitions are going to be good for and things like that. So the Lippin's Honor is interesting because it's one of those rare, rare occasions where something happened that wasn't supposed to. Because they weren't supposed to shift. It wasn't intentional. And whenever they did shift, um, they just decided to change the original skills to suit the ones that are already top on the game. Rather than trying to switch it back because then all those teams that had spent all that money getting all those horses really high up would have had to start over again because suddenly they'd have a, a horse that was essentially deprecated and it was no longer useful. So that's why they decided it would be better to change the original skills on the foundation weapons on it. So anyway guys, um, thank you to Briar Awesomeness for asking for the video. I hope you had a lovely day. Bye guys.